This is a number. Now, this number in Indian system. In Indian system, this number is 10 uh, unit, 10, 100, 1000, 10,000 and lakh. So, we say it is 4 lakh. Sixty-nine thousand two hundred and eleven. This is the number in Indian system. But if we write this number in international system. In the international system, this is unit, this is 10, this is 100, this is 1000, but this is 10,000. Here is the difference, it is not lakh, it is 100,000. So, how we will say this number? This number will be said like 460. Nine thousand, or you don't write it and uh, four hundred sixty-nine thousand. So we will say it along, like if there are three thousands in a number, one thousand, ten thousand, hundred thousand. So say it along four sixty-nine thousand, and then you have two hundred and eleven, four six four hundred sixty-nine thousand. 211. So, this is in the international system. Okay, you have the thousands, if you have the millions, say it along in ones. If again in a number, if you have Now, in this number, unit 10, 100,000, 10,000, and then 100,000, and then million and 10 million. So, you have 2 millions there. So, you need to say it along. In, at once, you have to say that these 2 millions are, will be combined. So, we will say 21 million. So, this is 21 million. After the 21, we have three places of thousand, so we will say 235,000. 235,000. Then we have 672. So, this is our number in the international system. Now, to differentiate it in this thing 2 and 3 and 3 or in the Indian system and the international system, we will learn uh, one more thing so that the reading out these numbers will be very, very easy. make it easy to read these numbers, we will say uh, how we can write down the commas here. Okay, So, we will uh, learn to put the comma in the number so that we will uh, say that uh, the number can be read easily. How we can do that? Use of comma. 